is the first Sunday in the last month of 2019. You are so welcome to Entertainment with Becky here on Joy Prime on your Multi TV, your Go TV, and your DSTV. My name is Becky. Today I am giving you an exclusive interview. It's almost uh, Christmas and it's almost the end of the year. Oh, this is so soon. But yes, of course, anything for you viewers, anything entertaining anything exclusive i'm bringing it to you today i have a veteran musician to talk entertainment with so you don't want to miss this particular conversation please join me no i, mean, I don't have anything against it if a man is responsible and i'm his first wife and he wants to marry you and he can take care of both of us Personally, I don't have any problem again. No, I don't. Please, I want to collaborate with Koda. Hey, okay. Koda, 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 Koda. Koda, if you're listening, can you hear me? I mean, but if I have one to do with the lady, Amy Newman is my Amy. We've been talking about it. If you're going through something as you're watching me, I want you to know that your case is before the Lord Praise and he has Lord. not forgotten about it. Praise the Lord. Please join me. This is Entertainment with Becky, and you are logged on to the Joy Prime channel. My name is Becky. I have a very interesting conversation I'm about to embark on with a very beautiful lady. <laughs> I've known her since I was one year old. <laughs> yes, and I'm so pleased uh, to be having this conversation with this particular lady. She's a gospel musician. Um, for those of you who are still old enough to remember, uh, the song Why Cry No Betty Miss Frey You know I don't have the that voice That song is about 21 years <laughs> Oh she's yes. right here <laughs> Stella Abba Seal or formerly for those of you who know know her those days Stella Dugan she's mm -hmm. right here to talk entertainment mm -hmm. I am so glad It's a pleasure I am so glad It's a pleasure It's it's an honor to have you on my show It's a pleasure How are you doing I'm great how old and look at how she's looking. <laughs> I am looking like a grandma right now. <laughs> Don't say no, that. I'm, I'm telling you. Oh, you make me feel like thank I'm you, a Thank you. But thank how, you. Thank you. How have you been? It's been like over 30 years. Yes, yes, yes. I'm doing well. As you can see, I'm blessed. Yeah. Yes. So, um, what happened? You just disappeared. Um, I went to the US. Um, I took a break. You know, okay. I have my children there. So, I decided to follow up and. Uh, regularize things and you know family is very important, important yeah. family is the bedrock of every society the fabric of society and so as long as I'm winning souls out there my I'm, I should start with my home first you know and make sure my home is in order before I, I I've done enough Mm. So I, I, it's allowed to take a break, but you can't stop. It is, it is, it is allowed. But you know, for the many people out there, for your fans, like I, I woke up one day and I uh -huh. realized that you know the gospel music industry uh, didn't have you in it. Yes, because you decided that you want to take care of family. A break. You know. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it, it, is a, it is allowed to take a break, but you can't stop. That's what I mean. Yeah. So I took uh, some time off, oh. you know, and though I was singing in America, but I, I was doing it on, on the low side. I don't okay. you realize I'm not a social media yeah, person. I don't post stuff. And it's for a reason. Okay. Because if I'm ready, I, I want to do it all out. Mm. I don't want to do it half half. Okay. So though I, I was ministering, but I was keeping it on a low profile. Mm -hmm. But now I'm ready to launch out. Okay, so yeah. we have a new product out. Well, let's, uh, well, you have something new? It, yes, I'll be going back soon. I'll come back. Okay. Yeah, okay. I but, came to do one or two things. So yeah. But but sitting back and, you know, while taking care of your family back in the US, mm -hmm. and you, you sit back and you look at the gospel music scene, yeah. you know, over the years, mm -hmm. What, what, what are your impressions about well, it? Well, um, looking from the hindsight, you know, yeah. uh, from the bird's eye view, I can say that it has really grown yeah. compared to when we started. I mean, 
I would say I'm one of the pathfinders or course, pace setters. Of course. Pace setters. Of course. You know, and looking at what we went through and the battles we fought, look at, comparing it to now, I mean, we there's a lot of major, major, major improvement. Mm. Nobody can give an excuse and say it's not working. Okay. Unless the real talent is not there, unless you don't work hard, unless you don't have a drive and the oomph mm for it. So now the young ones in this dispensation, they have more advantages, yeah. you know, especially yeah. with the social media, social media and, and stuff, you know. So uh, uh, um, I'm happy, you know, that the, 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 the effort and the work we put in, it's paying off, mm. you know, I'm very, very happy. What, what could be some of the challenges you faced back in the days, you know, uh, those days uh, shooting videos, was it very expensive? Do you have to go through like so many things to get a single video done? Um, the challenges that back then, now people have a lot of access and accessories. Mm -hmm. You can have your own personal small stuff that you can use for yeah. yourself. But back when I started singing, there were not even mobile phones, phones yeah. when I started recording. There were no mobile phones. When the mobile phones came in, you can't even see the numbers. You know, you just get a call, you have to pick, you don't know. <laughs> and then now there's email, you yeah. can have email. In fact, yeah. now telephone is a mini television in your yeah. hands. Yes. And you can reach the whole world with you the can, telephone. You can do a, a, you know, a video call. So the, the, the telephone now is a computer, you know. You reach the whole wide world and you can sit in the comfort of your home and broadcast the world. And that's the difference. It's uncomparable, mm. you know. Um, it's a better dispensation. No. And uh, I, I'm glad I'm alive to, 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 to see it and to, to join it and to be a part of it. it. Yes. Yeah. Looking at, you know, that fountain and looking at uh -huh. the pool behind us yes. reminds me of uh, your song and the video you shot yeah. for it. Um, why uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So afraid <laughs> you were on a little boat or... or I so. will never do that. I look, <laughs> I look back and say, really? <laughs> I did. What happened? It, what it happened? wager, you know, the, okay. the wager dumb oh my god okay I, I, I don't know how to swim but but so can you imagine really happy um, today <laughs> even if you give me ten thousand dollars you I won't do, do that it. no but but that song was so powerful it touched so many lives and um, what was the inspiration what were you going through at that point of, in, in your life what i was going through i wouldn't like to say it okay. i wouldn't like to I wouldn't like to share it, you know. I, I was going through something major that turned my life around. Okay. Uh, whether for positive or negative, I cannot tell. Okay. But that I was going through something and the emotions I was going through, I sang with the emotions and, you know. It related. Oh, I, I, I want to use this opportunity to encourage anybody who is going through one thing or the other. Mm. You know, David said, I will lift my eyes unto the Lord. From whence comes my help? Me more if you're ready. Mm. And so if you're going through something as you're watching me, I want you to know that your case is before the Lord Praise and he has Lord. not forgotten about you. Praise the Amen. Lord. Praise the Lord. I am blessed. Your Sunday <laughs> is blessed. But how many albums did you have um, back, back in the days? Do, uh, we, I think since it, we're still working I think on? in all, I have put together about 13. 13. 13 in all, yes. Which one would you say would be your favorite or which one would you say has lifted you, you know, to that peak <laughs> that we all okay, saw? Okay. Um, um, personally, I don't have favorites. Okay. I have memories. Every song has its memory. Okay. Uh -huh. You are the one who will say which one is your favorite. Oh, I just told you. <laughs> a lot of people like Jim Tata. I, I just they, told you. And they <laughs> like Dada Nina too. Dada, Dada Nina Ramosor, Meradi. Amamu Watamu. Amamu You know, so these two, I love them. But there are others. Hallelujah. I'm my friend, you know. <laughs> I love you guys to sing. Just miss, <laughs> we miss you. Oh my God, I 
miss the whole Ghana. So why is home it taking so where, long? Home is where the memories are. Why is it taking so long? Like I want you, you know, let's start something. I, I come. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll come you'll put, back. I just put this I'll go away for uh, a while and I'll and, come and back. Come Not back. too long. I'll come okay. Back. Yeah. Uh, so for those of you who don't know, December to remember yeah. uh, is a program put together by Prophet Samson Amwati. We have the House of Miracles inside Medina. Yeah. And St Auntie Stella will be performing yes. live yes. on uh, December 7th. Yes. Uh, yes, at the House of Miracles. We'll be talking more about that. This w should be her very first performance. Major. Mm -hmm. Her very first major performance after a very long time. So long time we don't want Ghana. to miss that. But we, we want to find out, I want to find out from you yeah. uh, what we should expect. Uh, obviously, we're expecting all the songs. <laughs> The I presence of there. God. I have a uh, desire to collaborate with a couple of people. people. Okay. Yeah. Do Which we have I, names? I, I don't want to really Oh, please. <laughs> please tell us. Please tell us. I want us. to collaborate like with Koda. Hey, okay. Koda, 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 Koda. Koda, if you're listening, I, can you hear me? Who else? Is he about How about the ladies? <laughs> ladies, um, I'm so thank you. You're still thinking I, about I, them. I like the men. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. I like the are, are the ladies troublesome? No, 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 no. <laughs> I personally like. Uh, you can see my nature. Yeah. I'm free. Yeah. You know, yeah. You know. An open, free uh, bed. Yeah. But I, I prefer. You know, opposites attract. I prefer the okay. guys. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, I mean, but if I have, want to do with the lady, Amy Newman is my. Yeah. Amy, we've been talking about it okay. all the time. We talk about it, so maybe when I come back, Amy and Koda, it means it's Takradi, Takradi region. Yeah, uh, yeah. So, so why? There's a fountain about to twirl. You anyway. see, I was, I was coming to that. You know, you're cho you're choosing your people, your people. Oh, I don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, you're not. I'm a Ghanaian. I know, but <laughs> let me tell you something very interesting. My grandma one one time told me that you're from uh, her hometown, Enumbosu. Enumbosu. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, Balia, ye, ye, no, I don't. Me Kambliya, hundred percent. So my my grandma told me that. <laughs> so so I got me confused because the fancy is there. And we don't really know where you're coming from. I know. I don't say it. Anytime I grant interview, you don't I don't talk say about because it. it promotes trouble, trouble, Tribalism. whatever. Okay. And everybody loves me. Why should I say that side with coming. I come from here? I come. Okay. No, I'm a Ghanaian. I, I yeah. understand. Yeah. I understand. I'm a it's, it's, could that also be the reason why you're saying you, you're siding with the fact that you um, don't have any problem with. Um, uh, uh, What's it called? Uh, people getting married to you know two people, polygamy. Um, are you asking? Give me my view of well, well, because uh, recently on radio, <laughs> on radio, you said well you, you support it totally, but, but you know that. Uh, no, I mean As I don't Christians, have anything against it. Okay. I, I really don't have anything. If a man can be is responsible and he and his first wife and he wants to marry you and he can take care of both of us. Personally, I don't have any problem with again. That. No, I don't. But but you know, as Christians, well, in this our society, mm -hmm. we don't encourage. There's no scripture. There's no to scripture. That. Yeah, but no. it, it, it has become a norm. Something that you know we've all. Come Is it to helping grow. us? Is well, it I, helping I, us? I, I don't if know. A, a married man can date you, mm -hmm. and rather date you, and after one month you call him, he doesn't pick. Mm -hmm. Is that what you want? It's better he makes gives you uh, security, okay. so you know this is the person I am with. Else, when he goes for a young ma woman, one month he dumps her, and then the young man has to as the woman has to accept any man that comes because she doesn't know who will give her security, okay. you know. And so, if you love, you think you love a woman enough, and you you, you want her, then do the needful. Else, fix your marriage okay. and zip up. And ladies, if a married woman comes, if a married man wow. comes and wants to have a talk with him, sit down, sit down, have a talk with him, get to know what his intentions are. If he that he's not going to take you far, close your doors and believe God. God will take care of you. You know, 
instead of opening for you know just because of alert I know that economic situation but at the end of the day by the time you realize four five men four five six men I speak with ladies and they have four five six men in their lives what for say we don't know who will put the ring on the finger and so you know God uh, God works with culture He's, he's not against culture. Mm. Uh, if you look at the Israelites, Judaism, you know, well, they are all into multiple marriages. And so if a married man can come for a single woman, why don't some men have given birth with women? Mm. And yet the children don't even know that that's my dad. Yet the man comes to the house every time, but the child does not know that's my dad. And then, then the child tells the man, uncle, tomorrow when you're coming, bring me yogurt. Why, why, why don't you become man up and own up, you know, yeah. instead of, you know, by the time the man is dead, the child doesn't have any, any future because, yeah. Yeah. you know, why? That's amazing. Yeah, it, it, it makes sense. I don't have anything against it. If a man is married and he's responsible enough and he wants to marry one, I don't have anything against it. Wow. <laughs> what instead of, it will curb, uh, sin it will stop sin and that is good for women in the sense that it stabilizes women you know instead of a woman running around running around he knows this is my man I see him twice a week at least he's giving me a place to put my head he provides for me if I need someone to talk to I call him you know and you the madam to you know that this is my rival if I can't find my husband I call you instead of Else, your mom my only dear grow too much, and my heart bleeds because I'm a mother, okay. and I am a grandma. My daughter has married, and so I wouldn't like anybody to play with my daughter like that. You know, married men coming in and out. No way, no way. You stop it, or you tell your wife I'm marrying her, or zip up, or you the girl, close your door. Don't come around. No, close up. Oh. Yes, you know. So, I hope you're listening. <laughs> I hope we're closing up. But apart from music, do you do any other thing like counseling or, you know, when you left, did you, what, what were when you I doing? Went, I, when I you was left, yeah. What, one, music. I am, a, I am, I always say I'm a mother okay. and I'll be a mother till I die. Now I'm even a grandma too. <laughs> Look at this grandma. Who thinks? Is this a grandma? Yes. No, it's not a grandma. <laughs> Woo! Okay, oh let me hold that for yes, you. Yes, yes, yes. No, 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 yes. no. You don't, you don't look like a grandma. How do grandmas look? Let me fix that. Grandmas yes. look like kind of me. <laughs> I know, right? You mean grandmas don't laugh? <laughs> they laugh. They laugh, but they don't look this sexy. Oh my That's God. my point. Gra so, 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 we'll call you Grandma Slay Queen. <laughs> So going back to my point, being a, 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 a woman, and not just a woman, a mother and a grandma, I've matured in life. My heart bleeds. My heart really, 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 I'll take off my glasses. My heart bleeds when I see a young ladies, though some of the young ladies, they push themselves on the men. Okay. Yeah, no doubt what about could, that. What could be the reason for that? I will say is it because we don't have enough men taking care of I have no idea I have no idea but my point is let's let's not let's not destroy the fabric of society uh, with this kind of uh, it doesn't please God okay the Holy Spirit doesn't like that jumping from men to men to men to men to men jumping from women to women to it's no good if the man wants you talk about what, it what is your plan? If you know he doesn't have it. God, he's a good God. He will take care of you, my girls. He will take care of you. You know, I don't, I don't want to talk too much because it's a, it's, a, it's a deep burden on my heart, you know. So if you're dating someone else who you think is not married and you are married, if you know you don't have good intentions, don't go there. Mm -hmm. If your marriage is disturbing you, fix it. Else zip up. Ladies, close the door. God put this big two ties and hid it. Somewhere. Yes, close it and believe God. I'm telling you, 
things will turn around. And, and trust me. So are you making money though? Of course. Do I look poor? No, you exactly. don't. Exactly. Of course. Exactly. You don't. <laughs> I mean, of course, if you if you're making money, then you're you're. I mean, at least but it's need... marriage about money no 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 no. i'm not yeah. even talking about mm -hmm. the marriage aspect I mean, yeah because she said you're busy i'm saying that mm -hmm. well, obviously, obviously mm -hmm. something mm -hmm. might mm -hmm. must have been coming out of it one day i was traveling um at the airport new jersey airport and i saw a billboard uh and it writes if you want to be happy for a year win the lottery okay if you want to be happy for a lifetime do what you love. Do what you love. So Life is not all about money. You're you doing know. what you, you love. Someone could be making money, but I tell you, the, the, the um, what do you call it? The, oh, the happiness? fulfillment. Okay, fulfillment. It's not there. It's okay. the fulfillment that makes you glow. You, you understand me? So if you want to be happy for a year, you can win the lottery, one million dollars. But if you want to be happy for the rest of your life, do what you love. I'm doing what I love. Mm, and I'll I, do it till I die. Even in a wheelchair, I will do it. And you fulfill. <laughs> Too much. You can tell. Yeah. I'm glowing. I, I love what I do. And you did your own makeup. I did my own. <laughs> you know, you y'all ladies. <laughs> take a seat, people. She's right here. And I I I'm really glad that I mean we mm -hmm. had this conversation. Yes. But um, we're still on the major performance. Yeah. You know, the very first major performance. Yeah. Uh, of Stella Abbasil. Mm -hmm. Yes. It will be happening at the House of Miracles, and uh, we're expecting God uh, to work through you. Amen. We're expecting the Holy Spirit. Amen. We're expecting you to perform all the songs. Yes. Yeah. Some of some of it. It depends on the time I'm doing. Please. <laughs> I I'm mean, not, I, I'm not the only person. You I know, know but, so. I mean, but, but I mean, yours is different. I have a lot of songs. If I'm to sing for two hours, I will not sing anybody's song. Yeah. I have recorded a lot. So it depends on the number of minutes I'm given. Then I limit myself. Yeah. But, but how soon is this new project coming? We don't even have a name for it yet. Not yet. So we're now going to work on it? Next year. I Next. Work, I, I've worked on it. Next they year are like they are three weeks finishing. away. They're doing finishing touches Practice. in the U.S. Okay. So next year, next next year. Next yeah. year. Mm -hmm. Okay. So do we have any advice for the young and upcoming ones who uh, have looked up to you? I don't have the voice. I would uh -huh. have told you that I would you know, follow your footsteps, oh. but I don't have the sweet voice that you oh. have. I think mine is just for sing, uh, no, yeah. talking. Yeah, but whatever you do, do it with passion. Okay. Do it with all your heart. And that's what the scripture says. That whatever your hands find to do it, do it with all your heart as unto the Lord. You know, Because he is the one who rewards us. You might think that is joy that takes care of you. Yes, joy gives you out of starvation allowance. But God is the one that takes care of you. So do it with your heart. Work for joy as if tomorrow will never come. And God who sees in secret, reward you and it goes to all my uh, young ones who, who who are singing or aspire to sing it's not a race it's not a rush it's not a competition in God's own time you know God works the time in his own time he will bring you some people are meant to be in the church just in the church to minister in the church some are meant for the nation but some are meant for beyond Ghana yeah. and so when you find your place play the role well and you'll be fulfilled and God will still take care of you just like anybody who travels up and down God bless you ladies and gentlemen Stella Abbasil uh, is been over 30 years and she's still doing what she loves yes. and she's fulfilled and uh, she's still giving you the beautiful music that you deserve uh, to enjoy uh -huh. and she has been my guest here on entertainment with becky i hope that you have been blessed by this conversation i hope that you've been entertained as well i hope that you've taken something out of uh, this particular conversation and please 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 don't forget her first major in a very long time yeah. performance uh, which will be happening at the house of miracles inside medina it's december to remember stars in worship put together by 
uh, Prophet Samson and Martin. Everybody will be there, of course. Uh, we will be there to support our mother, grandmother, uh -oh, beautiful grandmother, grandmother. You the living legend. <laughs> yeah, I was I'm coming to that. For this <laughs> no, 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 no. I take my words back. I am, so no, I am grand she, sis. I'm she grand is sis. the grand sis. She okay. is a living legend. She's yes. still here with us. <laughs> with you know all the songs that she love to hear. Mm -hmm. uh, would you like to bless us with one before we before we leave? Okay. Yeah. So, um, Stella Abasil. This is what you should expect. Come. <laughs> Uh, 7th of December, Can I share a prayer with your peace? Wherever you are, if it's possible, close your eyes, put your hand on your heart. If it's not possible, in your, whatever you are doing, you can follow me with, with your heart. Father, I thank you and I bless you. I give you glory. I give you honor for this day. I commit our listeners unto your hands. I speak a word of blessing over them from the crown of their heads to the soles of their feet. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Amen. I decree and declare health. I decree and declare long life. Amen. I decree and declare peace. Amen. I decree and declare financial blessing. Amen. I decree and declare good marriages. Amen. I decree and declare uh, uh, um, uh, financial increase Amen. over everybody's life. Amen. I pray that jobs will improve Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. And I pray, oh God, that you bind us with cords of love that cannot be broken. We Amen. commit the multi, the joy and the multi group unto your hands. Amen. We speak over the, the whole entire business Amen. to flourish Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We give you praise and we give you glory. Honor, adoration belongs to you. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Thank you so much. Thank you so Let's much. Let's take the offering. Yeah. <laughs> please bring the offering bowl. <laughs> Nat, please bring the offering bowl. <laughs>